Okay, the control thing is done. Elizabeth is swayed. Huh. Freyr. Freyr. He needs swayed. He definitely needs swayed. And in the martial duties, yeah, we want uh, organized levies. Perfect. Okay. Are you serious, man? Get out of here, dude. This is my target. You gotta be kidding me, man. And this guy is... <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Right when I come up here, these guys are at war, getting sieged. Unacceptable. Okay, finally a place to uh, to run after here. All right, then we're gonna go over here next. Oh, there's nothing here, just like hills and valleys. Uh oh. Uh oh. Jarl or peasant, high or low, it does not matter. In the end, we are all mortals. I was reminded of this as I woke coughing in the early morning hours, a dull ache pounding through my heart and throat. Okay. Hmm. I do know more than what is necessary. Helena insisted that my humors were out of balance and that the best way to restore them would be through bloodletting. After consulting the astronomical chart, she decided that I should be bled from my armpits and temples. Wow. The bloodletting turned out to be just what I needed. For now, the worst of my symptoms are alleviated and the world seems a little brighter. Excellent work. Okay. Whatever, man. Okay, and what's over this way? That's pretty much this guy. He is weak as hell. So, so we can just move inland, actually. Go pretty much wherever we want to go. Bounteous plunder. Yes. Alright, where to next? Here? Nothing there. Three there. Not worth it. Three there. Well, this place is totally... Just absolutely... Poor as hell. A lot of it's actually been raided before. This is just so open land, man. Wow. Hmm. Okay. Make landfall take everything. Oh, I captured his brother. During the siege, excellent. Wow, it's just there's nothing here. <laughs> there's nothing here. Only right here would be worth it. 
All right. Wow, he's young as well. Holy crap. Uh, sh wait a minute. Could we... Yeah, we can make him demand conversion. Or we can make him convert, I guess. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Now, where do we want to go next? I captured his son. <laughs> um, not there. Not there. Not there. There. It's the only other good place. And then we have a, pl a piece of water we can jump onto if we want to and just get out of here. Wow. Okay, that's not bad. That has nothing. Impassable terrain. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I wasn't even... I was still paused, my bad. Okay, with your 300 soldiers. An unexpected visit. Yet again, Sigbjorn is late for a council meeting. This time, I will not let it pass. When I arrive at Sigbjorn's chambers, I do not give him the courtesy of knocking. Sigbjorn is seated by his desk, writing furiously. As I clear my throat, he jumps out of his skin. He quickly stuffs a roll of parchment into his pocket and turns towards me with an uneasy look upon his face. Hmm. Let's go and... No, no, no. Show me what you're hiding right now. Did you really think I would not see that? Give it to me at once. Sigbjorn hands me the crumpled parchment and crosses his arms. It is a letter. There is something about a monetary transaction and the specifications for a custom-made tapestry with the Drinkerson crest. I wanted to surprise you, give you something to show my appreciation, and now it is all for naught. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. I had no idea. Oh man. Well, that sucked. <laughs> All right. I can ransom this guy for 25, sure. Okay, now where do we want to go? Like, all of these places are really militarily weak. But at the same time, they're not really wealthy either. It's not really worth it. Yeah, most of them just have three gold or nothing. This guy is 15. Yeah, let's go here. Look at that trout. No, we're, we're just going to go home. There's nothing really over here to get after. Well, except for here, I guess. Yeah. Let's go there. Get that 15 plunder. There's a river here. It goes all the way down this way. He's got a fair few soldiers. Hmm. Okay. Okay, Freyr gains opinion. The sway was successful.
I believe we have everything building here that we can. Yeah, we're building sparring grounds here. Same thing here and probably the same thing here. Yep. Ah, good. As I woke this morning and saw rays of sunshine falling through my window. It took me a moment to realize I had slept soundly for the first time in weeks. I did not wake up coughing once. Perfect. Yeah, we're actually building in all three of our holdings. The same thing, in fact. <laughs> for all of them. Okay, so we got that. Um... Let's go drop everything off. Let's go drop everything off. And maybe we'll head out this way. Boy, these guys are stacked with soldiers. Oh, that changed right before my eyes. That changed owners. <laughs> uh, well, down here. Have they been raided? They have pretty much been raided. Yep. There's a little bit of money hanging around here still. Alright, so... In Africa. We can go down and have a bit of fun. That is so far away, though. That is so far away. Okay. Let's go ahead and disband for now. 85, 85 again. I can't seem to find any really good targets. Okay. Maybe we do go after this guy here. In fact, let's let's slow down for a second. Let's take a look at our kids. I have a I have a tremendous number of children now. Freitas, um, she's not betrothed, and she could be. She very well could be. And we could try to wow. He has claims on all these titles. Okay, we'll not... Okay. So he's got a claim on that. Hmm. So we would be allied with this guy. Okay. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and do that. Wait, 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 wait. How old is he? Wait a minute, wait a minute. What happened to that guy? Where'd he go? <laughs> what? He disappeared. Okay, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Matrilineal. Hmm. Now he's Finnish. Wow, where'd the guy go? Did he die? Uh, Jarl Magnus of. He did. <laughs> Let's get the Finn in here. So he'll actually do do a matrilineal marriage. Which means any children will be born into my house. Okay. Let's do that. And then Hala... She is eight. Let's get somebody within five years of her. Okay, alliance formed. 
Um, Prussian. So he has claim on the entirety of Prussia. Okay, he won't he won't go for a matrilineal. Okay. What about this guy? He's got a claim on the southern coast of Finland. This guy has a claim on that little spot there. Ostergotland. Okay. That's this guy. But he has a bad trade. He's wheezing. Eh. Alright, what's this guy? He has a claim on all of that. Ow. Oh. Ah. Oh. And he'll do matrilineal. So that claim... If I understand this right, we can press that claim because he's in our family and he's on our side. Yeah, let's get that. That sounds like a plan. Alright, so our third... Uh, oh, Kraka. How did I miss Kraka? Kraka. She is rowdy. Fickle and comely. Okay. Alliance formed with that guy. Okay. Let's try matrilineal again. <laughs> Oh, a good trait. For the first time ever, I've seen a good trait on one of these Norse people, man. <laughs> Intelligent. Yeah, let's get this guy in. So they can have Intelligent and Comely as their inheritable traits. These two are going to be a good, a good matchup. Now, Ail Ailson. Who is going to look at being a steward. He is my heir, who I cannot get rid of, so... <laughs> Damn it. Alright, let's try to get him somebody good. Sif Siegfried Stoltier. She has a claim on that. I think we'll go for that. Okay. Now we're down to another daughter. I think at this point we're not too worried about matrilineal stuff. We're we're just wanting to get rid of them at this point. <laughs> we're just trying to get rid of them. You know? Well, that's another person with uh the claim on that. Now, how about this kid? Yeah, that'll be fine. Um, okay, guardianship. I'll, I'll worry about that here in a minute. Okay. And Solvi, the one who I want to be my heir. <laughs> Please, something happened to Ail Elson. Please. I want him to die. <laughs> Alright, let's let's think about a spouse for you there. There, buddy. Another one with a claim on Skane. Oh. That's a new one. She... Okay, both of these. Wow. That family has bad traits. Okay, get her club footed. Get out of here. Fickle and patient. Man. Oh 
by. They have a claim on all of that. But this one's first in line. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. You can still press it. No matter what. Okay. I think that's the kid sorted, except for the guardianship of in Ing Jurder. So let's see. You're going down learning. So that's going to be wasting. There you go. All right, some administration work completed. We have another perk. We can get sappers, which will increase our siege speed considerably. But we really want a strategist. So. So now what? Let's see here. We're up to 1,900 soldiers. We have an alliance with this guy. Who are our allies now? Allied with... Allied with him. Right there. Allied with this guy over here. Wow, that is huge. Oh no, that's just this little county right here. Allied with... This coastline here. And... With, I think it's over here. No, where's this at? Oh, right there. So now, if we go to war northward, because I don't think we have anybody up here that we are friendly with. Let's see. Yeah, if we want to go after this county, he has an inferior force because we have four allies and he has one. So let's go to war. Let's take it. I like the sound of that. And we want to raise all of our armies here. The music is so good. It is so good. A schemer discovered. It's my champion Arnie that is playing against my other champion, Haralder. Um... This guy is my best dude, okay? <laughs> Arnie. Arnie's my best boy. He's the bestest boy. Heralder is also a very good boy. With more kills under his under his uh his sword, I guess. Yeah, whatever. I mean, they, they, they don't like each other anymore. Who cares? I'm certainly not fussed. Not bothered at all. Let me group up here. Okay, okay. I'm trying to go to war here. Okay, game? Alright, some of my counselors believe the job is theirs by right of blood or influence alone. How wrong they are. I expect results, yet I am often disappointed. You got that right. So Freya is offering to teach my people. Uh, he doesn't want to be taught. Really? You're terrible. You're terrible. He doesn't want to be taught either. You're also terrible. The spy master is cool. So, we'll send you to go teach the Spy Master. <laughs> okay. 
Merge the armies. Go here. Take him down. Okay. So I'm going to call in... Not that guy. <laughs> Not that guy. This guy. Would you like to go have a bit of fighty war? Yeah, perfect. Good. They're probably going down here after my... Oh yeah, they're coming down here. To my capital. I've got three months left. They just started. They have seven months. Okay. And here's my ally. Can you go in there and uh, handle that, buddy? Wait, that wasn't my ally? I thought he was my... Oh, he's going up here. Okay, that's that's okay, I guess. Once I capture this, this is the holding area, the area under this contested. So, as soon as this is done, I'm going to run straight south. Okay. And handle my business down here. Are they leaving? Why are they leaving? Uh, hello? Yeah, they're they're leaving. So I'm gonna go here. Hello? Hello? I'm gonna go here. Help out with that. Because they bailed. They straight up bailed out. Okay. So we're almost done here with this siege. And we can come straight back. Oh, 100%. 100% enforced demands. Yes, please. To the brooding Jarl Ale, may your humors rot in your living body. You are a much greater foe than I imagined. In order to put an end to this bloodshed, I will comply with your demands. Signed, Jarl Steerbjorn Magnuson. Oh, such a great last name. Of, uh, whatever that is. So be it. Okay. Come down here and check out our new place. My prisoner died in my dungeon. Uh, did I have it? Wow, I just took him. Okay, so this guy is 100% on our side. Who else needs to be? Uh, Sunni. You need to be on our side. Yeah, we can just dismiss now, actually. And we want to have old boy here come up here and get some control of the area. They are Norse, as a true, so we don't need to do anything else there. Now I'm holding too many things. So... I need to designate a guardian for Solvi. Solvi, you're going down learning. I thought I already did that. Did I not do that? So I need to get a an earl. Or a vassal, not an earl. So... Let's see here. Hmm. 
Let's throw war camps in there. Cue that up before we do anything else. So let's look at my family. Freitas, um, decent, I guess. Oh, this guy. I actually need to sway him instead of the other guy. <laughs> I forgot about that. Um, Hala, do you not? I thought I picked you a spouse, lady. go for inheritable traits. Surely somebody has something. Okay, you are intelligent. Not bad stats. You're seven. So great stats for a seven-year-old. Um, will you do matrilineal? Yes. Excellent. So let's see here. None of my children are 16 yet. So, I'm going to have to go into my court. And my court physician doesn't like me. That's not good. Huh. So he has a claim on the Chiefdom of Gauntland. Where's that? Oh, that's that. A little island out there. Huh. Okay. So who do I trust to handle a county for me? You have nothing but fighting ability, sir. Heralder might not be bad. So... Firde Field Key. Would you like some Firde Field Key? <clears throat> so he gets 40 opinion of me. He becomes my vassal. Okay. I think Heralder. You're the guy. You are the guy to take care of this for me. So, we're going to do it. Boom. Uh, but now he is no longer fighting for me, unfortunately. So, for Alder. Um, Grant Independence, I think not. <laughs> All right, that's fine. Whatever. Um, so it's still within my realm. It's just he's controlling that county. That's fine. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Powerful vassal expects a council position. Heralder now considers himself a powerful vassal. What can you do for me, sir? Um, you can be the chancellor, I guess. Knock yourself out. Knock yourself out. Sparring grounds in Rogland. Uh, it's up here. Rogland. 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 No. Ah, uh, where's Rogland? Oh, right here. Okay, I get, I get it. I get it now. It's it's the county name, not the town name. Gotcha. 
Alright, so what do you want now? Would you like gathering halls or palisades? Hmm. I think, um, I think palisades would be good. Alrighty. Cool. So we uh, did a little bit of raiding. We uh, we got two new areas. So we we completed the duchy. Uh, to what it's supposed to be. And then we went one step further and got this guy here, Feared uh, Fluky. And um, so I think we've accomplished a little bit this time out. And, you know, I'm okay with, with leaving it here. Right after we take care of this, the enemy Rome thing, I think we're going to call it for now. So let's check this out and then we'll, then we'll say farewell for now. So while studying the tactics of ancient generals, I was astonished to learn about the exploits of Hannibal Barca during the Second Punic War. Known as the enemy of Rome, Hannibal's crowning achievement was the Battle of Cannae, or Can, or Can, is that Can? Where his army of roughly 50,000 outmaneuvered and encircled the larger 86,000 strong Roman army. Surrounded and unable to retreat, only 3,000 Romans survived the massacre. Wow. Okay. Oh, just get a trait. Aggressive attacker. Casualties go way up. Uh, logistician. Supply duration 100%. Flexible leader. Enemy defensive advantage minus 50%. Hmm. I think I'm going to take Aggressive Attacker. I think I want that more than the other two. This is really good. The negative 50% to defensive advantage. Hmm. You know what? That is actually the best thing here. <laughs> By far. Let's go that. Let's go that route. So... If you're watching on the YouTubes, then if you haven't figured it out yet, this is basically a series comprised of the re the um, live stream recordings for over on twitch.tv forward slash Lothan. So if you want to know whenever I go live, go ahead and go there and check it out. Hit that follow button. That way you'll get notifications whenever we hit that. Um, start streaming button. Otherwise, if you liked the videos, go ahead and drop a few likes down there. Let me know what you liked about it. If you didn't like it, please let me know what you didn't like about it either. That way I can always continue to improve. And as always, thank you for spending your valuable free time here on the channel. And we'll see you next time.